Well, we've really gotten away from, and I think appropriately so, the use of the word normal with lipid profiles. For instance, a quarter of myocardial infarctions occur with LDL cholesterol concentrations below 70 milligrams per deciliter. So no one is immune from the risk of myocardial infarction according to the LDL concentration. Importantly, the risk that that LDL concentration conveys to an individual can be reframed and better understood when the plaque activity test is measured. A low level of plaque activity implies that atherosclerosis disease activity, deposition of lipid material, and the risk of plaque rupture in coronary heart disease events is very low. And in some studies, the uh, lowest values in the population's patients have no events over time. So this test, in my view, pro pro provides really clarity on what the lipid profile presents to clinicians in terms of uh, cardiovascular risk and prognosis.